Welcome back, everybody, to Season 1, Episode 9 of 7 Days to Die Survival Series. My name is Lainey from Nerdly Gaming, and this is Day 9 of our survival. Um, if you were here yesterday, we have been working or making our cement mixer and our workbench, which are now done. And thanks to some people in the <laughs> 7 Days to Die, I realized that we don't have a land claim block yet. That's why I can't pick them up. So we have been digging a little bit. And we have now decided to finally put this down. Now I've enclosed it a little bit, but either way, this needs this needs a lot of work. Um, so I've been working last night on making this shaft underneath the base. It's not done, obviously, and the sides are basically just scaffolding because we need to be able to get in there and clear some of the dirt out and replace it with with um, support like this, but. For now, it's going to be okay. We've destabilized the base a little bit, though, so we have to be a little bit careful of what we do. But it is a brand new morning, so I spent all night last night doing this. And today is a brand new morning, so what I think we want to do is we want to get out of this shaft, finally, and go out there and either do some looting or do a quest or... Um, I don't know what we really want to focus on today. I think the best thing to do is to just try to work on making the bicycle just because that will get us around a little bit easier and if we can walk around easier then hopefully we can just get to every quest, get to everything we need to do a lot faster. So today's goal will be to find a way to make this bicycle no matter what. Um, we might have to go and wrench some cars or I'm not sure. I don't even know if we have enough bottles of acid to do it. So that will be contingent on that. And if we can't find the bottles of acid to do the bicycle today, then we're just going to go and to the trader probably, try to get a quest. Or we're going to hit up the army POI that's nearby because uh, whether or not we just keep mining for this sword base, we are going to need some ammo. It doesn't look like we have a bottle of acid at all. I thought we found at least one, but I guess not. So to get a bottle of acid, we're going to need to hit up a lot of POIs. So maybe that's what we do today. Oh, we aggroed him. Hello. Good morning. Nice. Well, let's do the junkyard first. Uh, just simply, it looks like it might not be that bad to clear. It's going to be a little bit big, but that's okay. Wake up. Wake up. Okay, hello. <laughs> he hit himself on the barbed wire. That's pretty funny. Okay, we're going to head open this up. And go in. Night Stalker. Do 10 more cents sneak damage at night. Okay. I will take it. Might have to put a box outside of here. I can already tell this place is going to be thick. There is an actual insane amount of trash here. So I'm going to pick all this up and then we're going to head inside. Goodness, we have a little horde coming our way. And we are encumbered as hell. Okay, we're running. <laughs> oh, they should not be able to come to you when you're doing POIs. <laughs> so many. Okay. Well, the first thing we want to do here is we want to go outside and make a storage box. Because we are super encumbered already. Put the 
this over here. Right in the balls. Well, that was a decent amount of experience coming our way just for free. So that's good. And there's definitely something beating in there. We'll put this iron in here because we don't need it right now. Same for the porch iron. We'll come pick you up, hopefully. Hopefully very, very soon. Got another wrench. 19, 20. So this one's a little bit worse. Just a little bit. Oh, we might have to sell that one. It might give us some good coin. Some more duct tape. These trash piles are a gold mine. Now we're almost done here, I think. Uh, we just have this piles here and then we can go inside. Which is going to be delicious in there. I'm sure there's a lot of stuff. Ooh, another one. Night Stalker. Never encumbered at night. <laughs> well, we might just uh, wait till nighttime then to move that stuff back home. It might be a problem. Um, with the runners, but it's not that far from home. So there's that. Uh, I need to make some wood frames. I can hear the zombie coming my way. Just mind your own business for a little bit, please. Where is it? It sounds so close. Oh, there it is. Nice, we got some food. I don't know why there's nurses at a car place, but... Maybe they really like this model. I mean, it's one of their best. She does look pretty cool. Uh, I think we got all the other ones. Yep. And we got the cars. We'll have to come back and wrench the cars. Hopefully we'll get a point in salvage operations before we actually wrench all these, but... If it's got to be done today, it's got to be done today, so we'll see. Oh, we have a skirt. Uh, yep, that's worse. <laughs> that's just worse than our pants. We're going to go outside and put the stuff in the box as much as we can. Oh, there's like a dungeon here. Well, we're going to do it. We're going to call him, too. Might as well have a party. Oh, I hit them both at once. That was amazing. Stay down. <laughs> nice. Uh, she's so good. That's like an awesome model as well. I love her. Big lady. Oh, it's arm. And Raiden's balls. That's for coming at me. How dare you. Keep your distance. Personal space is an important thing. Um, let's see if... Oh, this is a working one. Very nice. Yeah, I knew you were going to wake up. It's fine. It's all good. As long as the puppies don't find us. Those were out and about yesterday. There's been a pack of puppies, like, roaming around the house for a little bit now. And I've been sort of ignoring them, but... It's getting to the point where we might not be able to ignore them. Cold resist 13. Oh, this is just better. Oh my goodness, this is actually incredible. All right, well. And we are going to wrench the beds. Because sometimes they give you springs, which are super valuable because I think they're steel. And I don't have any steel, so. Oh, yep, there's definitely a base down here. We're going to have to come back and explore that. We're going to finish the rest of the building first, and then I'll deal with that. Can I get out of here? Yeah. Okay, so this was a way in as well. <laughs> I didn't have to break through the wall. Uh, let's do downstairs first. Oh, no. We do have a bandage. 
No problem. But yeah, that was pretty dumb. <laughs> I hate reloading. <laughs> Alright. Let's just go for a hammer. It's more trusty. You can basically down them, even though we don't hit their head. <laughs> it's great. <laughs> nice. Okay, I think we got him all. There's another one beating on something, but I don't know where he is. Maybe it's this guy. We'll just make a way out, because I don't care. <laughs> Come on, boys. Let's go. Let's go, let's go. Let's do this. I think they might be upstairs. Oh, no, it's a crawler here. That was easy. <laughs> you had no chance now. We are so powerful. We'll wrench this because we found ourselves out of parts last time. We were trying to make the cement mixer. That's unacceptable. Let's get some food and water. Perfect. Now I get these because the polymer is pretty good and I hate being out of polymer. It's needed for like quite a few things. And you can just get it later. There's other ways to get it as well, but it's just an easy way. And I always forget if I don't get it right away. Now we got another wrench. When we had a hobo stew. I don't think we're going to have to get another res another point into Master Chef. I think we're going to be good by just finding the recipes from now on. Um... 18 damage and this one has 20 so ours is still better very nice so we got two wrenches to sell to the trader so that's that's pretty good and another thing we want to do is we want to go back and deposit all of this um, we're okay so far but once we're done with this top area we'll go back um, i'm gonna wrench this because i'm gonna forget it's up here but the cars I can do later. Oh, this is just the entrance here. Let's open it up. Why not? Okay. Very nice. I think we got everything down here done. Um, I think we if we do the second block. Oh, no. It's not cement. It's stone. So it's still going to take a little bit, but it's not going to be that bad. So I'll see you guys in a little bit. I feel like I'm going crazy. I feel like there should be something down here. But there's not. <laughs> um, is it a chance to be in here? I'm opened up that way as well. I feel like I'm losing my mind a little bit. That's bedrock. I doubt they'll make us go through rock to get in there, right? Look, we might just have to come back because I don't think this is a thing. No, yep. Yeah. I've opened up two of the sides already. And it doesn't seem to be leading to anything, which is weird. I don't think this would lead to anything. Yeah, that, this is a weird one. I mean, let me know in the comments if I'm missing, if I'm missing it, but I'll come back later. If it's, if it's a thing. Or if not, we can actually mine there. I mean, it might not be that bad, but for now, let's just get out of here. I'm going to mark this on the, on the map. The waypoint, uh, we'll call it a chest. I've, I've named things like so weirdly, but we want to get a bike so we can pick up all the drops. We can pick up all the chests. Uh, we have so much we want to do. And let's keep walking. I mean, I did, I did see a garage somewhere, so maybe I can find it again. Clunky oil. Maybe that will do it. Let's hit up let's hit up this. So we're gonna just make our way through this. Hopefully they'll help us out a little bit. Come on, friend. This way. I'm even making you a path in. This is unacceptable. Use your brain, please. Oh wait. <laughs> right, he's down my goodness this sledgy is getting better and better just living it up okay we got a tire now that's obviously better than getting an acid bottle but amazing we just need one more or two acid bottles I think we'll do the trick as well okay so it looks like there's an entrance this way 
There's a couple of more workers here that we're gonna take care of. And then we're gonna clear out the outside before we go crazy and go inside. That's for sure. We got a quest. Nice. Okay, we're, we're just gonna make it all the way around. I know I've woken up everything in there, but that's okay. I don't think our intention was to be silent here. Now, hopefully nothing will come behind us. Nice. I love the power attack. It's risky, but... I love it. Ooh, somebody blew up. <laughs> That's what you get for coming after me. How dare you. How dare you. Disturb me. Okay. Well, uh, as predicted, this is pretty... Pretty empty on the outside. We'll come back and wrench all these cars. I haven't forgotten them. I just... I don't think I should wrench... When I haven't even put a point in salvage operations. Look, if we don't find a bottle of acid or another tire, we are wrenching. We're wrenching all night. If we have to. Let's read the challenge. Kill some chickens with the nail gun. Okay. That's... I, I just feel like that's not ever gonna happen. But we'll take it. Why not, I guess? And we'll map this box before we forget. In my box. Okay. Alright, well, there's a lot of buddies coming my way. Their AI does not seem to like this spot here. I don't know why. I I've made it so easy for them. To come my way, but they just seem to want to attack there. But that's fine. We have plenty of room to run, so we're gonna go in. Oh, nice. Actually insane. <laughs> Very nice. Okay, we got our point, and we are going to put our point into event, um, Grease Monkey, so we can actually get our bike. So, that's that was the plan. Now, they've made their way through here. Oh, this is so much gas. I guess I should have expected it. It's called gas. And go. Hello, buddy. This guy gives me such trouble. All the time. All the time. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. There's just something about him. I'm like already intimidated. See, I just don't know what it is. I'm like terrified of him to the point where I can't physically react normally. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. I don't know. That's the zombie that really gives me trouble every time. Let's see what's in here. I, I've taken the, the complete wrong way to get in here, but I don't care. Oh, a gun safe. Nice. I think we do have some picks. We do have some. We do have some. Oh, and we found more. Okay, come on. Give us some good stuff. Okay, it took four picks, but that's okay. We're in. We found some ammo, so that's great. And a hunting rifle. Oh, I love hunting rifles. Sucks that it's a level one, but... I love them so much. Okay, that door's locked. So I think that just leads to that, so it's pointless to open. And was there any other door? I don't think so. I think that's it. I mean, yeah, that just leads to the same one over here. Interesting. I mean, we'll knock this out just in case, but... Yeah, it just leads to the outside. Okay. Well, I think that was it for this BI. I mean, I'm sure I missed something. Well, we tried looking on the roof, but there is absolutely nothing up there. Is that just how it goes sometimes? And we don't have a lot of time, so let's just clear this little camp. Ooh, a mine. Oh, that was close. That was very close. So we gotta be a little bit careful. Very nice. And okay, we got a couple of these, like, scientist guys that happen to die. There are so many mines here. Quite literally a minefield. Okay, 
Okay, you're gone. How many more of you are here? Probably a lot. Oh, this is an insane amount of bones. Come on. Come on, guys. Wake up. I hope there's no mines inside the place. Or puppies. Nice. This ledgy is so trusty. Okay, so I think we got him. I can hear something outside. Let's hurry up. Is that a puppy? No. Now we'll have to either stay here tonight or we'll have to finish clearing it before 2200. We have our hopes up. At night, we shouldn't be encumbered running back, so we're going to try to sprint back. I don't know if it'll work, but we're taking the chance. Uh, that'd be nice. We got a honey and a scrap metal helmet that is worse than the one we're using, so we're not going to use that. Just scoop the cement. Now, I think for the rest of the night... Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. No, 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 Run. Oh, that was terrifying. Why do you do this? Oh, we got food poisoning. Cool. Cure infection. I don't think that's what we want, though, right? No, that's not what we need. Well, this has put a bit of an, a sad end on our day. <laughs> I out of stamina because I have a total of like 20 stamina. Nope, 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 nope. Well, food poisoning is actually horrible. Great. I need to find some food. ASAP. I think I left some in the box. But let's try to kill you. And I guess it's nighttime soon, so we'll we'll head back. Okay. Well, we are almost home. We can see it in the horizon. Yeah, well, our hunt went pretty well. We got one tire. And I can't remember if we need anything else at the moment, but... We're just going to throw everything in here and get to mining. For tomorrow, though, we do want to go back there and see if we can find more. Well, we have Gambit up a little bit. I think there was a car place. I'm, I might be going insane, but I think there was like auto parts, auto repair. I'm not sure. I guess if it wasn't there, then maybe it's over here. Uh, we'll, we'll take a look tomorrow and see if this is the spot or not. If not, if not we'll figure it out later. But maybe it's over here, and I just thought it was there. Yeah. So let's finish. Uh, maybe we'll just focus on clearing the rest of this until the next horde night. Just to see if we can get as much resources as possible. I do need a lot more ammo. <laughs> I, I do. It's going to be pretty bad if we don't find a lot more ammo. But um, everything's looking good. I feel like I know that there should be an acid bottle in here somewhere. But we have one of the wheels, so it's already looking... It's already looking up, right? Um, we need crushed sand, small stone, and cement. Well, we definitely have some cement. Oh, we can start a concrete mix, finally. It's happening. Okay, as soon as this is done, we'll start reinforcing the blocks. Uh, first, the ones that got destroyed last time, so the outer parts at the bottom, and then the inner parts at the bottom. And then from then, um, I guess we can focus on the on the inner pillar, which is this which I think can hold everything else if all else fails. So this definitely needs to be reinforced. Uh, yep, yeah, but this is it for today's episode. Thank you so much, everybody, for watching. We were so close. We were so close to finding our bicycle. The, the acid is really bumming us out. It's really doing a number on us. I, I don't know how else to to find some more, but we have one miserable tire, and we are so happy about it. 
Yeah, thank you so much, everybody who made it to the end of the episode. If you would like to see more episodes, please consider leaving a like or subscribe and leave any comments down there in the comment section to let me know, you know, how it's going or what you'd rather see on future episodes. If you want just more hunting for POIs or, you know, more questing or more building, whatever you prefer. Uh, unfortunately, right now we are kind of stuck trying to upgrade at this base so until that's actually reinforced enough to survive i don't know like uh the higher uh, horde nights we're gonna have to keep just working endlessly on this but yes thank you everybody and we'll see you next time have a good one